I'm writing my discussion chapter for my PhD thesis and it's not just intellectually difficult as I have to contextualise and situate my original contribution to knowledge amongst all the rest of the knowledge. It's human difficult because as I do that I am reading and reading and reading and like I've just finished reading a really interesting paper written by an academic and a parent of a child with profound intellectual and multiple disabilities in which she makes a very clear and powerful case for respecting embodied knowledge in healthcare. And she does it through telling the story of her son's admission to hospital and the way in which the philosophical paradigms that societies run on affected his care. <laughs> so you think of philosophy as being really abstract and dusty and then there it is right at the forefront of care. And there was a single sentence in that paper. It's a densely written, academically convincing, eight, nine page journal article. And, and one sentence of it said that during the hospital admission she's describing he died. So I, I met him and then and and I saw he I read he was in pain and I read his mother was fighting and then he died and if that, that all happened in eight pages. And it's not the only thing to read today.